Did you ever see Mr. Depp appear intoxicated? No. Did Ms. Heard ever show you photographs of depicting injuries on her face or body? No. Did Ms. Heard ever tell you that Mr. Depp was abusive towards her? No. The internet has indicated that Amber and her team have indeed been either threatening or gaslighting a lot of people who supported her ex-husband. Another person who might have fallen prey to Amber is her ex-friend, Jennifer Howell. How has Amber roared at Jennifer for supporting Depp instead of her? Should Jennifer be scared? Amber Heard saw Jennifer as one of her few friends that would support her regardless of what her truth was. But she was wrong, as Jennifer has resorted to social media to share her truth. And trust us, Amber is not pleased. So fans are wondering, did did Amber get so angry that she threatened Jennifer? Well, let's dive deeper into what really happened. A document from the 2020 court declaration came to light amid the just-concluded defamation trial between Depp and Hurd. Howell's declaration revealed her side of the story of Depp and Hurd's 2015 staircase fight involving Henriquez and Depp's infamous finger injury. She claimed that Henriquez told her that Hurd was hostile towards Depp, contrary to Henriquez's statement in court. Jennifer Howell went further to state that she learned about Whitney Henriquez's testimony at Johnny Depp vs. The Sun's UK libel trial, and realized that it was the opposite of the account Henriquez allegedly shared with her in the past. In her testimony, Henriquez mentioned that she had to sleep on her employer's home floor after Depp and Hurd's 2015 staircase fight. Howell clarified that she was the employer, and Henriquez didn't sleep on the floor, but came to live in the guest room of her Wilshire Boulevard apartment. Contrary to Henriquez's statement in the London trial, Howell claimed that Whitney told me she tried to stop her sister Amber from hitting hitting and attacking Johnny on the stairs. Whitney said when she tried to intervene to stop Amber from going after Johnny, Amber nearly pushed Whitney down the stairs. Jennifer Howell claimed that Henriquez told her she was worried Heard would kill Johnny. Henriquez also allegedly called Heard extremely violent and said she had to endure a at her sister's hands for her entire life. She further mentioned that Henriquez moved in with her as she was terrified of her sister. Howell also said that Henriquez told her that Deb continued to check in on her and called her sis while she called him brother. This declaration has created more confusion among the fans because Howell's testimony is completely different from Whitney's. Besides, there's no obvious motive for Howell to lie, so she just might be telling the truth. Could this be the reason Amber might be threatening her? Howell went on to claim that Henriquez discussed the infamous fight between Johnny Depp and Amber Heard in Australia, and the latter cut off Depp's finger. Henriquez said, oh my god, she has done it now. She has cut off his finger. Jennifer Howell also claimed that Heard asked her to write a character reference for her charity work after she faced legal trouble for allegedly smuggling dogs in Australia. She wrote the letter and gave the Aquaman star a humanitarian award. And when the trial began, Jennifer dropped a bombshell, showing that she was being threatened. Jennifer posted pictures of her house door that had been broken more than once, with someone trying to get in. Does this mean Amber tried to threaten Jennifer? One fan said, Jennifer Howell told the truth about Amber Heard. Amber broke into her home and reported her to the IRS two days before the deposition. She's been investigated by the FBI for witness intimidation. Victims don't act like mob bosses. Amber Heard is an Another added, Jennifer Howell cares more about the truth and Amber Heard's sister Whitney than Amber does. People need to start talking and stop lying to her. She doesn't care about anyone but herself. That should be clear by now. Justice for Johnny Depp. But Amber's fans are saying a no-no to Jennifer's claims. One fan commented, Jennifer Howell offered nothing that proved Amber Heard was the Victims of abuse often become reactive after years of trauma. This can include instigating a confrontation in an attempt to control the narrative and to take some power away from the user. Peace. Another added, Jennifer Howell says nothing about Amber having a history of abuse. Amber Heard reacted to Johnny Depp's abuse. Listen to the number of times Johnny Depp and his associates admit he loses control and assaults Amber, both in audio and in writing. In all, fans hope Jennifer is safe and perhaps out of Amber's sight for a while. And if you liked this video, make sure to check out this next one.